this is what it's left on the ground and it's a nasty black shit but it's all right here came out and out of the skid plate one thing you do always need to do <laughs> on these vehicles with the air suspension on car ramps jacking it up whatever put the tire jack mode Besides the coolant leak, well, not getting coolant on the ground, but I've got some dark oil on the ground. I mean, dark. It's coming from this side of the engine, which is interesting since oil filter pressure switch sensor is over here. The usual suspects vehicles. Not seeing it. Really up on. The engine anywhere it's not coming from the valve cover from what I can see it looks clean up there <clears throat> it dropped it onto my skid plate the front plastic portion it seemed to be coming out right here and where I back in there was a little pool of it it's here's some of it right here that is black as black could be but the engine oil still looks great doesn't it so it doesn't look like what are these aren't fluid filled motor mounts are they on this vehicle because it's nasty right there yeah, it looks like it's dripping down right there huh. it looks pretty centralized to this one area right here it doesn't look like it's coming off the, out of the engine or anything so that is good kind of had me worried there like uh, if I could get into something already on this so water pump easy I actually have warranty for that and then maybe a motor mount here, which looks pretty easy. Unless it's this whole aluminum piece. But it looks a lot worse than these. Two bolts there. Probably one on top, I guess, is what I was guessing. Can't feel it. Yeah, it's got this fucking heat shield on it. What the hell? Heat shield straps to the engine pedestal, whatever you want to call it there, to the mount. So this does have air suspension and all that goodies on it. So I wonder if the motor mounts are like just some uh, interesting type. And they're blown out. This one doesn't have fluid coming out. But it also feels soft down there, I think. I can't get my finger on it like I can. This one. But These are interesting because, I mean, what motor mounts are like this? It is. It does feel like there's something in there. Oh! What the fuck is that? I think we have the culprit. Here's my dilemma now. It's almost thinking of going and getting motor mounts and everything, but... Um... This has passed the 36,000 mile warranty, bumper to bumper, but when I got it uh, at close to 50,000 miles, I got the three year warranty, you know, aftermarket one at the dealership. So I think I'm going to go talk to them and maybe schedule let them replace the motor mount and the uh, water pump <laughs> for free. Even though sometimes I still do it myself, I had that warranty on my F 150 and I fixed everything myself regardless. Man, sure amazing that all of this is coming out of that motor mount. I mean, that's quite a bit of fluid, but I just squeezed this out of it. Man, get some carb cleaner on this. Look, I jinxed myself doing that video. How good it was this rooftop, because now I gotta bring my vehicle down to the dealerships right here.